type of game. So, yeah. If it was made for the Nintendo 64. And done by Koi. People known doing And for, Omega Force. Yeah, known for doing uh, all the Mozu games or, you know, like the Dynasty Warriors and stuff like that, which is nice. Oh, are you going to screen share? Yes. Give me a moment. After the intro's done. Yeah, I'll go ahead and do it right now. There you go. <clears throat> yeah, see? Seeing these characters, I'm already... It's already screaming Metal Gear from their faces. Like Liquid Snake and McDonald Miller and all them other... And, you know, so many others. Or maybe you could also say... They look like characters from, um, I don't know, Time Crisis or some shit. All he's just waiting is showing the, the characters, the characters' names plastered on the screen. This is Big Boss. <laughs> With shades and a beret. They're taking over the satellite and threatening the world if they don't give in to their demands. So if you wait a couple cutscenes at the tile screen, you'll see more of the intro cutscene. Though you have to get two of these gameplay demos first. Oh really? So I gotta sit through these, huh? Oh, you can skip this one. Just press start or A. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of, I kind of rather not spoil just yet, you know. <clears throat> All right, here's. Oh my God, I hate that gray box. What is that's that an mean? emulation issue? It's an emulation issue. Oh, okay. Here, just skip this. Just skip. What is it meant to be? That's kind of score. Nothing. Oh, that wasn't meant to be their period. Okay. Yeah. Secretary of Defense. Is this report accurate? I know it sounds hard to believe. The Center for Space Research destroyed in an instant. We detected a strong energy blow seconds before the blast itself. On site reports mention a bright light from high in the atmosphere. What? No, it can't be. Get me the control center and at Westham on the At Westham. Okay. Sorry to barge in, sir, but we've got trouble. It's terrorists. We've just received word. I'll set it up so that you can see it here. Terrorists. My name is Kenneth Coleman, and I am the leader of the Crying Lions. The Crying Lions? What? I want you to make sure you understand your precarious position. There is only one way you can prevent a repeat performance of the Center for Space Development. You must carry out the following demands explicitly. Okay. First, you must withdraw all military personnel from Sarkozia. Second, you must confess your crimes to the world and make an apology renouncing your invasion. Third, you must swear before the world that you will never again interfere with Sarkozia. We have no intentions of bargaining with you. Our demands are final. Failure to comply will bring dire consequences. I am sure that you know what that implies. Your unholy weapon of destruction serves us well. Make your decision quickly. That is all. after Metal Gear 2? <laughs> as far as our intelligence staff can tell, they seem to be the remnants of a military group who were defeated during the Civil War in Sarkozia. Sarkozia? Well, have you located the Gulf Satellite's present low position? I'm afraid not, sir. The Satellite Control Center was destroyed with the Space Center. Damn. That rules out utilizing the new anti-satellite missiles. Mr. Secretary, 
We don't have much time. Have you considered calling in the army? They never make it in time. Those damn flying lions wouldn't hit us before they ever got moving. I believe it was the crying lions, sir. Then how... Get word to SCAT headquarters. I want them in the air ASAP. Brilliant, sir. If anyone can handle a job like this, it's them. I'll send word right away. You do that. Alright, so yeah, like you said, um, and we'll get, the, get used to the hang of things, so let's go tutorial for this. And you're not counting this towards the I, I, time? I will be nice and not count it towards the 50 minutes. It wouldn't be fair. All right. Here we go. Hold your weapons, press R. Okay, so this aims. This lets you... Yeah, it's a bit like Resident Evil. It's a bit like Resident Evil 4. Okay. <laughs> My character's name is Jean-Luc. Jean-Luc Cougar. That's actually got to get a ring to it, now that I think about it. You press A button when your weapon is loaded, it reloads automatic. Okay. That's if you're out of ammo. Yeah. Okay. I'm probably going to be doing that quite a bit. Oops. Oh, yes. You'll be covering and firing. Okay. You'll be doing four war rolls a lot in this game. To dodge enemy fire? Yes, that, and to avoid traps. Ah. Uh. Yeah, there are five different weapons in this game. It's a good thing at least one of my weapons has unlimited ammo. Yeah, I personally prefer using the handgun. Shotgun. Back to the pistol. By the way, if the control stick seems a little too loose when you're aiming, it might be a good idea to change the sensitivity of the control stick and the options for the emulation. Oh, I'll try to make do with what I got. I will say the auto aiming will either be your best friend or your worst enemy. Depending on the crowds, right? Yeah. Try using the down C pad on those enemies when you're crouched behind the corner. Oh, okay. You press C down. And you while well, and you can switch between enemies if you press left or right on the control pad or C pad, sorry, yeah. not the control pad. I always try to go for headshots. So you'd have to aim the laser Actually, aim, a little yeah. bit. High. Yeah. Because it just kills them instantly. Alright. Personally, I don't really like doing hand-to-hand -hand combat unless you're able to sneak up behind them and do that. Yeah, because I, I noticed just kicking... On, on, from the front, you're just kicking them in, 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 in the front, and it's like... Kicking doesn't do jack shit. It doesn't do jack shit, yeah, you're right. That's like, you're, if you're gonna go hand-to-hand, -hand, you're better off just taking them out in one hit from behind. 
Otherwise, you're just yep. you're just the silent to get but deadly method. Yeah. Let's see what objects. I'm guessing boxes. There's a red cursor when you aim at it. Okay. Woo! All right. Okay, I see an emulation issue where the lasers are going through your model. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, there's a lot of laser traps in the game. Okay, yeah, that seems pretty obvious. Don't get too close to that when it drops, otherwise you'll take damage. Oh uh, yeah, because those explode, don't they? Oh yes. And they do a lot of damage. Jump down? Nope. You have to climb down. I see. Whoop. Press the A button to Ooh. pick up items. Okay. Yeah, the frame rate was acting a little wonky there for a sec. C4 explosives. Shotgun shells. Press down to The control the pad down. Ah, okay. Right. A magazine. Medikit is not needed this time. Okay. Okay. I got it. Actually, I just saw a key that you might need. Where? In the other room. Can't leave here until you defeat all the bad guys. Oh. oh. Well, guess you shit. can't go back. Never mind. Yeah. I guess it wasn't that important then. So let's What's see up, how Razor? much you learned. Don't forget about your other weapons, too. Also, when you use the machine gun, don't reload too quickly or you'll waste a magazine. Actually, crouch behind that blue, that little blue box, and then take out the enemy by, by showing yourself. You don't have to. Shit. Ah. Damn it. You can use the C left and right to move the camera. Yeah, that's gonna mess me up. It keep every time I, tr I I try to do a, the the aim on that, it like it it just crouches downward. You have to hold R, remember? Ooh. You can shoot that explosive box to kill them. I 
I recommend hiding behind those brown boxes. there damn it are you trying to do that yeah it's not gonna do you much good from this angle in fact it's next to useless shoot that explosive box quick You have to stand up. You're out of ammo and you gotta reload. You can reload while you're crouching too. Okay. See, like I said, I gotta get the hang of it. Ooh. You're in danger. You're in danger mode. I could have done a lot better. Doing well? I'd say that wasn't doing very well. No, it wasn't. Fight. Better reload. Ooh, you're in critical mode now. Shit. Better switch weapons. You are dead. I feel so compelled to say this. Oh my god, you fucking idiot. Do I start over, or do I start from the boss fight? Oh, okay, I start from you the boss fight. You start from the boss fight. Try going for them headshots. Don't forget about being able to lock on with the down C button. And remember to use the camera. I know. Yeah, I can. Oh, there we go. Well, at least you, at least you got through. 